What is your favorite Topeka memory? My favorite Topeka memory would have to be, I'm not sure what year it was, I don't want to age myself, but we won, one time it rained out and we went back to Topeka, I think in September. It was freezing cold, it rained, we ran the final round about midnight, it was live on TNN, that's how old it was, and I beat Al Hoffman in the final, and right in the lights, the crankshaft broke and erupted in fire, and I still won. And it was uh, like the most incredible win on fire, uh, you know, beat a legend like Al Hoffman. And then I remember we couldn't, it was so late, we had to go celebrate at the local truck stop. That's, there was nothing open by the time we got to uh, where we could celebrate with Roland Leong and my crew. So that's my, my, probably my favorite memory. I don't have any real favorite, I guess I do have a favorite memory. I can say uh, we qualified number one there a lot. Our car always runs there a lot, but Topeka's probably been like my thorn to my side. It's been the kryptonite to my Superman abilities. <laughs> So, I mean, we always do good there, and uh, I just want to win that race so bad because it's got some special feelings to me, this moment from Gary Armsby days. Got Gary Armsby drive, one of my heroes in the sport, and I just want to win there so bad, but uh, I just haven't got it done yet, so uh, hopefully to make some good memories this year coming up. Easy. 2012, Todd Smith had come in three races before. We had a DNQ and a first round at the last two races. We went into the final against Caps as the decided underdog and we left with the trophy. Piece of cake. I would definitely say 2011, I got my first ever Don Schumacher racing win and top fuel obviously at Topeka. It was uh, one of those races to where when it's your day, it's your day. There was ups and downs, but we beat Bob Vandergriff in the final round to get the first win and that is definitely my favorite Topeka memory. I guess it'd have to be uh, 1998. We were running an alcohol funny car there. It got uh, really cold. It rained. They kept putting us off, putting us off, and I think they finally ran us around 1 o'clock in the morning in alcohol funny car. The track was stupid cold, stupid fast, and uh, anyway, we ran real good. I have to say, I, I think our only win there, you know, was uh, one of those tracks like Atlanta that just eluded us for a long, long time, and we went out and put the right combination together and, and uh, you know there's tracks like Indy where we've won nine times and then there's Topeka and Atlanta which we just struggled at so going out and winning uh, for the first time was a great one. You know uh, been out to Topeka a couple times and uh, it's just a great track it's one of those things where it's a lot of farmland uh, you know so it kind of feels like home for me so uh, getting out to Topeka it's kind of one of those things you get around and uh, I guess uh, see what you can get into and see some uh, some farm life. Well, back in 1999, when I had a one-car top fuel team sponsored by Exide Batteries, you were a really young little girl, a uh, young lady. I'll, I'll call you a young lady at that point. But I can remember being in Topeka and us talking about going downtown in Topeka, but you kept calling it Potika. <laughs> Some fans saw us downtown and made a comment and asked you about the race team and everything else, and somehow you got into commenting about not even know how to spell Schumacher as of yet. You were that young and that sweet, which you still are today, but those are my favorite moments about Topeka.